Hey guys, welcome to the Vainglory Hero Spotlight. Today, we're looking at Grace, a paladin of Githia who leads her team into battle by charging forward with a giant mace. Grace utilizes the power of the light to protect her allies by granting them holy shields that greatly reduce incoming damage. If the fight seems bleak, she can turn the tides of battle by calling upon the Seraphim to bring her allies back from the brink of death. Grace's heroic perk is Retribution. If Grace performs a basic attack on an enemy, she may hold her ground in order to deliver a stronger Retribution attack that deals bonus damage and slows enemies. Retribution attacks strike in a cone in front of her and can miss if the primary target moves out of the way. Each successful Retribution attack will also lower the cooldown on all of her abilities, making it key to land these attacks whenever you can. Grace's first ability is Benediction. Grace dashes to a target enemy, delivering a swift retribution attack that applies the same slow as her heroic perk, while also dealing bonus crystal damage in a small area. Upon activating this ability, she will receive a holy shield that will temporarily reduce the damage she takes from enemies. Nearby allies will also receive a directional holy shield that will reduce incoming damage. This holy shield will always face the direction of the target struck by Benediction. Upon learning this skill, Grace will also permanently reduce all damage she receives. Benediction's Overdrive resets its cooldown whenever Grace casts her ultimate. I recommend learning this ability at level 1 and maxing it first. Grace's second ability is Holy Nova. After a brief channel, Grace damages and knocks up all surrounding enemies. If Grace fails to damage an enemy with the ability, she'll be rooted in place for a small period of time. Holy Nova's Overdrive grants Grace immunity to crowd control effects during the channel, making it impossible to interrupt. Grace's ultimate is Divine Intervention. Upon casting her ultimate, Grace gains a Holy Shield which reduces the damage she takes from enemies. After a short channel, she also casts a heal that restores a large amount of health. If Grace uses Divine Intervention on her allies, they will also receive the same Holy Shield that she does. In our first team fight, you can see Grace leading the charge against the enemy Batiste using Benediction. Grace moves forward while Batiste is still slowed from the Retribution attack, activating Holy Nova. By positioning herself in front of the enemy hero, it makes it harder for him to avoid the attack. She catches two enemies in the knockup, giving her allies time to deliver some heavy damage. Grace turns her attention to the nearby Glaive, and uses her Retribution attack to lower the cooldown on her abilities. Soon, she is able to cast another Holy Nova, knocking the two enemies into the air. Grace then uses her Boots activation to sprint forward in front of the fleeing Glaive, delivering one last Holy Nova, stunning him and sending him to the nether. Grace's proper positioning throughout the teamfight allowed her to land three Holy Novas on the enemies, clearing the way for Kraken to demolish the enemy turrets. Let's take a look at how Grace can turn the tide of a fight. Caught out of position, Rona is brought dangerously low, and despite using Fountain of Renewal to restore her life, she is still on the brink of death as Finn lands a huge forced accord. But the enemies underestimated the power of the light. Grace uses Benediction on the enemy Finn, creating a holy shield that reduces the damage Rona takes from behind before casting Divine Intervention. The holy shield she grants from her ultimate manages to not only keep Rona alive, but allows her to pick up a kill as well. Grace and Rona manage to walk away from the fight, and later come back with their teammate to score an ace. Grace was able to turn a misplay from her ally into an opportunity, and secured the outcome for her team. Divine Intervention can also be used to protect Grace from damage. She dashes forwards towards the enemy Batiste, not realizing the Glaive is about to make a play on her teammate. Deep within the enemy backline, and with her teammates unable to follow up, Grace takes massive damage from her opponents. In order to save herself and her ally, she immediately casts Divine Intervention on Vox, mitigating a large amount of the incoming damage. Vox was able to take out the Glaive, and with Grace's help, the team turns on the remaining enemies, finishing them off with ease. Thanks for watching the Grace Hero Spotlight. Download Vainglory free on the Apple App Store, Google Play, and Amazon App Store.